Hello everyone. In this video, we have this interesting problem. We have AB is equal to 4, BC is equal to 6, and lastly, AC is equal to 10. And we have to find the value of A squared plus B squared plus C. But before we begin, if you are new here, please consider subscribed and also don't forget to like this video. Now let's get started. First, let's compare these equations to this one, right? Now, if we compare this first equation to this one, you can see that this equation lacks c. So let's introduce c by multiplying through. So we have abc is equal to 4c. And I'll call this equation equation 1. Now, if you check the second equation, you can see this one also lacks a. So let's multiply through by a. So we have abc is equal to 6a. And lastly, you can see that this third equation also lacks b. So let's multiply through by b. So we have abc is equal to 10b. And I'll call this equation equation 2 and then this equation equation 3. Now, if you compare these three equations, you can see that the left hand side are the same. So we can straight away say that 4c is equal to 6a, which is also equal to 10b. Now from here, let's divide through by 4 so that this 4 will cancel this. Now we have C is equal to 2 goes into 4 2 times and then goes into 6 3 times. So we have 3 over 2 times A and this is also equal to 2 goes into 4 2 times and goes into 10 5 times. So we have 5 over 2B. Now let's set this equation to M, where M is a constant. Right. So from here, we can find three equations out of this. We have C is equal to M 3 over 2A is equal to M. And then lastly, we have 5 over 2B equals M. Let's make A, B, and C the subject from each equation. Now you can see this one we have no problem because C is already the subject. Now from here we can say that A is equal to 2M divided by 3. Then from this equation we can say that B is equal to 2M divided by 5. What is the value of M actually? Now from the third equation, I mean this one, we have AC is equal to 10. Now we know that a is equal to 2m over 3, so we have 2m divided by 3 times c, we have c to be m, so we have m here and this is equal to 10. If we simplify the left hand side, we have 2m squared divided by 3 is equal to 10. Now if we cross multiply, we have 2m squared is equal to 30. Now let's go ahead and divide through by 2 so that this will cancel this. Now we have m squared is equal to 15. And let's call this equation, equation star. Right. Now from the problem, we have to find a squared plus b squared plus c squared. We know a to be 2 over 3m. Then we also know b to be from here 2m over 5 so we have 2m over 5 then plus c we know c to be m so it will be m squared and don't forget that we have square here now let's simplify this we have 4m squared divided by 9 plus 4m squared divided by 25 then plus m squared if we find the LCM of 9, 25, and 1, we have 2, 2, 5. 9 goes into 2, 2, 5, 25 times. 25 times 4, that is 100 m squared plus 25 goes into 2, 2, 5, 9 times. 9 times 4 is 36. Then we have m squared here. Then plus 1 goes into 2, 2, 5, 2, 2, 5. So we have 2, 2, 5 sorry, 225 m squared here. Now let's simplify the numerator. If we sum the numerator, we have 
361 m squared divided by 225. But from equation star, we know m squared to be 15. So we have 361 times 15 divided by 225. Now let's simplify this. 15 goes into 225 15 times, and then 15 goes into this 15 one time. Now we are left with 361 divided by 15. And this is approximately 24.1. So this is our final answer. I hope you found this video useful. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day and see you again on the next video.